All right, welcome to today's session with Tegris Consulting. My name is Jarrett Donaldson, and I'm a consultant here on the team. And in today's demonstration, what I'm going to show you how to do is use the drag and relate feature. Um, and it's a really nice you know, tool that SAP Business One has that when you first start using the system, don't always realize is there. But what it allows you to do is create on the spot um, mini reports of data you might need without having to create a query of any kind. And it's located over here in the main menu. Mine's right here on the left box. I'm using cockpits, um, drag and relate. And it looks very similar to what you'd see on the module. It has a few of the same folders, but just not as many. Um, and sometimes it's up here um, when you're not using cockpit as well. It just depends on, on what version and you know if you're on HANA or, or uh, vice versa. But in my case, it's right here directly. And so the way you do it and how it works is, let's say you're in any kind of a field of SAP. Let's say I'm going to pull up the business partner master data. And I'm going to uh, terminate there the user defined field window um, and pull up, I think the first record, I think is uh, Tegris Consulting. And so let's say I had pulled it up, Tegris Consulting called in, I, I found their name, and I needed to find out um, all of the invoices we've ever done or the sales orders we've ever done for Tegris Consulting. What I could do is click in the drag and relate, drill down to the sales AR uh, folder, and then it's going to list all of these possible mini reports I can create. Um, and You don't actually click on it, but like the title says, you drag and drop um, to get a relation between one field and then one type of document. So if I'm going to come over here and click on Tegris Consulting, their, their card code, the customer code, A1000. If I click and hold down, you'll see a black border come around it. And if you keep holding and just simply drag and then drop wherever you want it to go, so let's say sales order, it now is going to create a mini report um, that shows all the sales orders for Tegris Consulting. So I only have four here, so I don't have a lot, but I can drill down if I want to. Click the golden arrow, let it pull up that sales order. Um, and in your case, you might have you know thousands of records, so you might want to filter it down. You can come down here and do a filter, and then filter by something. Whether it's your posting date, you might want to say it's greater than you know this date, or vice versa, and you can filter your results. Um, so it's a really nice tool to create a custom report. And you don't just have to drag the customer code; it can be a number of things. So let's say I wanted to see all the AR invoices related to this phone number. Let's say I have multiple business partners with that phone number. I can click, drag and drop on the AR invoice and there's my list. There's four AR invoices that have to do with that phone number. So, you know, there's a lot of possibilities here. And I, like I said, not all of the, the folders or modules are here in the drag and relate and not all of your, you know, windows will relate, you know, all of your fields relate to it, but play around with it because the majority of them do and you can grab a lot of uh, valuable pieces of information and, re, you know, many reports by using this and instead of creating a little query. So. That concludes our demonstration today of the drag and relate feature, um, but please take a look at our other videos for more tips and tricks on using SAP Business One.